Testing. Well, it works until it messes up. I'm still having issues with this fucking computer. Ahoy there! Hey, Paul, what's happening? Yeah, I'm still having issues with this thing. I still got one more stick of RAM to test. It sucks having four sticks of RAM. At 128 gigs. Cause it takes a long time to test that shit. And I got one stick left to test and all of, all of my RAM sticks have passed. Unless it's the last one, which could be the culprit, but I don't know. I'm still having issues with this thing. The bad thing is, is when I started doing memory tests on this thing, with the memory test 86, now every time I reboot my computer, it wants to go into safe mode and into BIOS now. I have to force it to fucking start Windows through BIOS every fucking time. It's fucking dumb. I, I would have been, I got off like three hours ago, by the way. I would have been on like three hours earlier, but I've been fucking with this for three hours. And you know what? I was like, screw it. I can get it to boot up. And I changed some of the voltage settings to the RAM and stuff and just telling us to do certain things and stuff. It's running at a different speed right now. But I'm still, it won't boot up on its own now. I'm going to force it to fucking boot up through BIOS. It sucks. Yeah, it's always something. Damn, why am I like half dead? I forget what I was even doing. I can't really talk to him. Let's get out of here. Says I'm breaking the law. Let's talk to this dude. Dave. What kind of governor is Sir Hanish? Young Sir Hans is our governor. Okay, I was just checking checking the sound because I've been pulling RAM out of my computer and everything else. And when I log back in, back in my camera settings are all screwed up. I'm just hoping it didn't mess with any of my sounds. Okay, yeah. What will we do? Ah, oh, yes, that's right. We stole a bunch of stuff. My respects to. Didn't I have another bow? Get rid of that bow. We can get rid of a torch. Anything else? Do we have a treasure map? We should probably go look at that treasure. Maybe. Let's see here. Can we read the book? Okay. Get rid of those books now. We have an ear. <laughs> wow, dude. <sighs> God be with you. Yeah, it sucks. I wasted a lot of time messing with it, trying to figure it out. I honestly, I just hope it fixes itself at this point. <laughs> I don't, I'm just so tired of messing with it. Damn it, I had that book too? I thought I read all my books. Well, that's when we had to study.
Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's head up here. I'll probably get stopped by the guards or something stupid. Whoa, 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 where are you going? Good day to you. Matter of fact, train him. I'd like to me improve my. Certainly. See if he can train me. I want to which you can. Okay, you can't do this. Well. Wow. Take care now. Well, let's go back down to the team. How much money do we have? 1.3. Yeah. Let's go see if we can buy the best sword they got. So yeah, if I go offline all of a sudden, it's because I had a blue screen of death. <laughs> like I said, I did up the voltage slightly to my ring. But even before I did that, I tried to default it would do the same thing. Alright. I want that sword, but I can't afford it. But that's the sword I want. We shall get that sword eventually. We could just steal it. But... I've done enough stealing. So we are going to go here. Is it the same rank? Oh, yeah, it is. I'm going yeah. to drive my horse. If it crashes, it'll be while I'm riding my horse like this. It takes a lot of processing power to stream and fucking do all this at the same time. It's moving fast in the game. We'll see. We need to drive up the bow to the yeah. find a good clearing to drive my horse up the mountain. Now, this is an exactly an idea. Ooh, what do we have here? We made it. Idiot. How you doing, Paul? You doing all right? Yeah.
Let's not murder everybody in this town. Could be better watching Euro. Koopa Vanga every day. Soccer, if you will. Yeah. Are you like a soccer fan? Harry, I've never been a fan of pretty much anything. I mean, I, I watch, I sometimes watch football, but that's about it. Yeah. Yeah, I agree with you on that. If you, I've, Mr. Hunter hits that all. Dude, I still think sports would be played so much better if uh, if their teams won games, then they got a big pay bonus. Tell me how much better any kind of sport game would be. <laughs> you know, a lot of them don't even care. They just, you know, there's just an athlete and then that's it. Do they get paid whether they win or lose or fucking fuck it all up, you know? There's like no, uh, no incentive. What's happening around here? Ah, you know how it is. Always something, especially at the mill. Not a week goes yeah, by I agree, without Paul. some ruckus there. But I'm wise to them troublemakers whenever they're planning some mischief. They're always huddled there in the corner, hatching their plots. Like yesterday, for instance. And that's not all. Now I think of it. I've not seen Kunhuta here for some time. The local herb woman. Yeah. She always comes here once a week for a tankard of ale. Or, or if they got penalized for making recently. mistakes. Well, nothing's happened to her. Oh, and another thing. Like Vatsek has started an archery contest here. If you want to try your luck at winning a few crushing... You should go and see him. Something. Actually, penalizing probably wouldn't help. Being a pleasure. Yeah, I don't. Actually, if they penalize, if you penalize the referees for making mistakes, they would always just sit there and fight to the end and say they were right. Get it right. So no one else tries it on. You're banned for life. Damn, now you're pushing it, dude. That's brutal. This guy looks um, bandit. Oh, hello, Mr. Hi. Bandit. Nobody knows where he is. is he... Let's save it right here. These guys look bad. We'll wait and see what the chief says then. I don't want to pick his pockets. I wanted to talk to him. Wash yourself. I washed myself on his face. I washed myself out of his cup of mu his mug of booze. I'm looking for a fellow called Riki. Do you know him? Riki? You mean Hinnick, the courier's son? Maybe. Do you know where I might find him? He's not usually around here. Try asking at his home, but I hope you've got a thick skin. Your courier ain't exactly charming. So you know this Hinnock. Can you tell me something about him? Not much. I confess. Most of the village folk avoid him like the plague. Why is that? No one with a nose likes spending too much time around Tanners. And that Riki keeps bad company. I've never heard a good word said about him. <laughs> he got cage fights in UFC shit. Boring. Yeah, I... To be honest with you, I don't even watch that stuff. I really don't watch hardly anything, man. I like interacting with what I watch, and that's what we're doing right now. You know what I'm saying? Of course we can't leave him be. Plus, no commercials. What can you tell me about the old courier? He's as cantankerous as a hog in a thorn bush. He won't talk to anyone. It's about our fucking reputation. Uh, Why do they call him at Riki anyway? He's a tanner, isn't he? If you're ever downwind of him, you'll understand. 
Tanning isn't a trade for the weak of stomach. True enough, but not every courier gets cursed. Yeah, look how nice like my that. armor is. Well, Hennick's nature is no sweeter than his smell. You <laughs> moron. <laughs> That's just why we have to get it, right? Don't tell me there's not a single person who talks to him. He's been seen around with one of the bathhouse wenches. Adela, I believe she's called. Well, while we're at it, did you ask about him at the village? Aye, nobody knows where he is. Seems he's always wandering off somewhere. We'll wait and see what the chief says then. <laughs> do you think uh, you sit with others and they uh, train the do you think peasants? Basically, I don't know. I just don't like being part of the pack. Does that make sense? I just, I just don't, it's just not an interest I have. I don't know. I, I don't know. I'm weird like that. Machine reactions are worse than. What's that? What is this guy's problem? Are you having a fucking fit, buddy? Listen here, buddy. Hey? You gotta. Tanner, let's talk. I hope I can be of some humble service to you. I'm looking for your son. Any idea where he might be? I don't know nothing. Don't you at least know where he usually goes? It's important. You're entertaining. Phoenix shows up at home once I don't know about that, man. So I don't know I try, nothing about I try to be gets. entertaining. Even if I did, why would I tell every Tom, Dick, and Harry? I, I shouldn't say I try to be entertaining. Let's just say it becomes entertaining. I try to make it a little bit entertaining. But it always winds up being entertaining. No, no, you're, no, I understand, dude. Watching me get pissed, dude. And I mean, hey, it's it's better to just watch someone else do it and be going through it yourself, I man. It's it's funny to watch. I, I can absolutely understand that. Listen, your son's in serious trouble. I'm trying to help him, and my patience is wearing extremely thin. I'm about thin. to punch this dude if already. If you start answering my questions, this is <laughs> going to go a lot better for everyone. Are you threatening me? Yes, I am. I'm supposed to believe you want to help Hinek. Believe what you like. I'm concerned about Hinek, but I really don't much care what happens to you. Is that clear? Fuck it. I'm not going to take a beating on account of that good for nothing. So? There's not much I can do for you anyway. Hinek came here, but he left right away. But where did he go? You better give me something. You really don't want to waste my time. Hinek makes some money on the side from poaching. He boasted to me a few times about what a great hideout he found in the woods. <laughs> but he never the game's told me too hard. It no. Well, it's not much to go on, but it's better than nothing. Thank you. Don't you have any clue at all where his hideout could be? I really don't know nothing about that. I could tell when he'd come from there is all. How's that? Because every time he brought some hides for tanning and money. The money he brought home. I need to know more. What more do you know? Nothing. I swear to God Almighty, I've said all I know. Hinnick never told me nothing. Make an effort. Bloody hell. Start using your head or I'll never find Hinnick. How much time did he spend away? What was he wearing? How did he look when he came back? Anything? Well, he came and went at all sorts of hours. I really don't know. Except maybe one thing. He'd come home scratched with brambles and with leaves and muck on him. So he probably went through thick woods to get to that place. I reckon. What do I know? He had money because he sold the stuff right away. I suppose. He never <laughs> kept any of his loot here. Do you know who he sold it to? <laughs> no. But the innkeeper came here now and again and gave him coin. Of course, it could have been for me. All right. I'll ask at the inn then. I don't know, man. I don't know if you've noticed, no. but... And if he's really in as much shit as you say, please try and find him. I don't know if you've noticed, but 
the Henry, the character I'm playing, he's a dick. <laughs> At least this playthrough he is. <laughs> Klepto and KC. What, what do you mean by in KC? I'm illiterate. You have to explain. Oh, Kingdom Come. Kingdom Come. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, Kingdom Come. Gotcha. It took me a minute. It took me a minute. I mean, anybody who's like a straight ass, everybody's all nice and everything. I'm gonna. I would be nice if it was my first playthrough. You really can't get it into your thick skull, can you? It's about our I already have my coffee for the day. I drink me one cup before I go to work. How can it help our reputation? And folk already shit themselves when they see us. God fearing. Who's this dude? But in this trade, even your own people Who's this person? Otherwise legit. they might get the idea they can do without you. Get it? Alright. God be with but you. Fellow ain't one of us, you moron. That's just why we have to get it, right? So no one else tries it on. It's all the same to me. I'll secure him anyway. Just I can't be bothered looking for him. Well, while we're at it, did you ask about him at the village? Aye. Nobody knows where he is. Seems he's God always left. wandering off somewhere. We'll wait and see what the chief says. <laughs> Oh, dude, if I play through it, I'll blow it up. I'll blow it up just for you, dude. I know what you're talking about, too. I want to ask about the courier's son, Hinek. But ask someone else. They've nothing to do with Riki. He only drives my customers away. <laughs> really? I heard a different story. I heard the two of you do business together. Who are you, anyway? A friend of Hinek's. He's gone missing, and I need to find him. I don't know where he is. But if you find the bastard, tell him he still owes me some goods. Oh, we're gonna be a dick. Here we go. Here's another dick movie. Ready, Paul? Watch this. We're gonna get mad at him. I've no time for this. I have to find Hinek, and you're gonna help me. Am I now? Even if I did know, why the hell would I help you? This is a nice alehouse you have here. Beat your ass, buddy, if you don't tell if me. anything happened to it. <laughs> are you threatening me? Yes, I am. Think? So are you gonna talk, or do I have to beat it out of you? Fine. Let's get to the point then. <laughs> See now? Yeah, there's a will, there's a way. Well, it's going around about Ray beats him But I swear to God, I don't know where he is. How much game did he bring you? Not much, a few pieces. There's no great demand here. Sometimes the gentry is something, otherwise it ends up in <laughs> sausages. I know. I hear Hinak has a hideout in the woods he uses for hunting game. Do you know where it is? Not exactly. That is... I don't know where it is at all. But? But I happen to know it's a dark place. A cave or an old mine shaft. How do you know that? Whenever Riki was going poaching, he always came to me first for candles and lamp oil. He brought the game skin and gutted, so we had to have a light for that. And do you know of any mine shafts nearby? There's a few of them around. There's one on the opposite bank, a uh, short way off the path leading from the forge to the west. Then there's a mine gallery to the east of the village, uh, up in the woods above the cliffs. And I heard there's one shaft on the headland close to the water. Thank you. You're welcome. Watch you don't break your neck, though. It's rough ground, and you could easily fall down a shaft. I have to threaten him, threatening his life. He uh, decided to help me anyway. But nope, it's closer to other schools. Yeah, I know. Dude, I think it's awesome, dude. Oh, man. Yeah. Let's go this way first. I thought you said, oh, when you first played, oh, you played, yeah, you played Kingdom Come, though.
No. So we're going to B. Yeah. Up, 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 oh, push, up. Yeah. in here. Get our torch. Oh, this isn't much of a fucking cave. This is obviously not it. Let's go to yeah. D, I guess, which is which is closer. Yeah, D. Yeah. These damn bushes mess me all up. Dude, now find somewhere to cross is gonna be another story. here. Damn, we're booking it, dude. We're gonna run straight into some enemies. Damn it. Wait, is there anything in here? No, nothing, no good, nothing. Yeah. That sucks. Be the last damn place I love. Then I got E. Gotta go to E. Yeah. Try playing it but with 20 SPS and shutter. Oh, and this. Oh, damn. That sucks. Yeah, dude. That really ruined the experience. Yeah. It's better off not even playing it if you can't play it at a decent. You have to at least be able to play at 30 frames. At least. That is like the minimum. Yeah. Heavily relies on the room. I don't know what it heavily relies on. I mean, it may be one of the reasons, like I said, I get a I crash when we're riding the horse and shit. I don't know. I still gotta test that one stick around. I'm probably never gonna fix it. I'll just boot it through the BIOS every time if it doesn't give me no problems. I'm just tired of. I'm literally tired of messing yeah. with this computer. You should have been working out of the box, and I should have had no problems. Period. Yeah. 
especially for the kind of money I paid for it. Oh, is this a little, cool little rest area? Can I sleep here? Damn it, I was thinking about resting here. Yeah. Is that a cave? What is that? Hmm, what did we find here? Ooh, it's a hard chest to unlock. I unlocked that shit too. Shoes were those. You know what doesn't matter. Can't wear them anyway. Lucky plane dies. I learned a new recipe. Dude, doesn't any of these fucking potions like heal me? <laughs> Cool. Hey, that is healing me. Slightly. Yeah. This is the place. to do not that I can expect any useful advice from you at least you have no more cares need someone to talk to fuck don't, don't kill me I, I can explain I won't tell anyone I swear I've no one to tell anyway just please don't kill me I'm not planning to kill you you're not one of Runt's men? No. Huh. Then who are you? They're coming for you. I came to warn you. They're coming for you. That's so. Good job. I'm hiding out here then. They killed your friend, Lubos. Nailed him to the door of his own house. Ah, why do you think I'm in hiding? If you don't want to end up like him, you better tell me what you know. And how will that help me? 
If they come to a bad end, they won't be bothering you anymore, will they? And if you help me, I guarantee they will come to a bad end. One way or another. Fine. What do you want to know? That Neuhoff raid of yours didn't turn out quite as planned, did it? Depends on whose plan you're talking about. We were up to it to grab some loot and bugger off. Only Runt's cutthroats was there to shed blood. What do you mean, Runt's cutthroats? There were two gangs there. Mine and Runt's. We was only there to steal, but they wanted to slaughter everyone. But when you realised what they had in mind, you didn't have to go along with it, did you? But we didn't know nothing, even though we were going to Neuhof. They told us to keep watch on the courtyard while they were cutting the horses' throats. Jesus, that fucking vexed me. Their horses was the most valuable thing there. When I spoke up, though, Runt gave me such a bollocking I knew I'd better keep my mouth shut. And when they said we was going to kill anything that moved, then we knew there was no going back. Tell me exactly how the raid went down. Um, well, we stormed in from the rear. Runt's people started slaughtering the horses. Jesus, that was bleeding horrible. Meanwhile, me and Limpy had a sniff round the stables to see if we could find anything worth pilfering. And in the end, we got lucky. What did you find? Smill, Sir Hanisher's groom. I don't know why he was up and what he was doing in the stables, but... We took advantage of the situation. Limpy grabs him by the throat and I slapped him round to encourage him to tell us where the money was. Then it all fell apart at the seams. Quicker than you'd believe, Runt comes running up and skewers the groom like a pig for roasting. My jaw dropped. I thought the stuff about killing was just tough talk. And it wasn't? No, not in the least. What happened then? I'm gaping at Smill, stuck through and through, and I noticed this boy standing at the other end of the stables. The stupid sods pointing at us, jaw hanging down to his knees, saying, I know you. Run turns to us and hisses. Take him down. So me and Lubosh start running, because the lad took to his heels. At the same time, we could hear the noise of the skirmish in the courtyard. We caught up with the boy at the next farmhouse. Knock him to the ground, but he bashes me with some piece of iron so hard my head's ringing like a fucking church bell. Limpy grabs it off him and stands over him, with his bodkin in his hand, and I start praying. In the end, Limpy just gives him a kick and says, beat it, Ginger. And then Runt shows up at the gate and hollers that we gotta go, so we scarp it. What happened after the raid? We were waiting for that fool, Timmy. Same place as we met them before, so he'd know where we were, right? Stupid fucking idea, but Pius didn't want to leave him behind. Only when Timmy finally turned up, two of Runt's men were dragging him. There was some difference of opinion. You could say that, yeah. They started on us right away that we were traitors. They knew we'd let somebody get away and now we were going to pay for it. They started trying to surround us and we knew what was coming. But Limpy took his bodkin and let that fucker have it in the belly. Runt! One of the others. Timmy broke free from them and we all took to our heels. Luckily, they were so buggered from the raid they didn't follow us for long. They just shouted that they'd find us. That gang of yours, what can you tell me about them? Don't know what you want to know. There was four of us. Me, Timmy, Limpy Lubosh and Pius Pava. Sometimes we'd rob a place or hold up pilgrims. Never nothing fancy. I'm sure you did mischief enough. Who led you? Pius. He was the oldest and he'd mostly find the jobs for us. Plan them and the like. He got us into that fucking mess in Neuhof too. What about the others? Timmy's strong as an ox with a brain to match. You got more sense out of a fence post. And Limpy. (laughs) I've been with him the longest. He's my one and only friend, I suppose. Who got your two gangs together? You must have made contact somehow, right? Pius. He comes to us and says he's got this prime job. We're going to rob a farm, he says. That was a big deal, because mostly we just did small stuff. A hold up on the road now and then, nothing fancy. When they told us how much we could make on it, well, we just couldn't refuse. So Pius knew them? I suppose, but I don't know where from. We even got paid up front. I should have known from the start it was too good to be true. Where did the rest of your gang end up? 
You saw Limpy, right? Yes, but he's no use to me now. Tell me where I can find Pius or Timmy. I don't know nothing about Pius. He vanished in the woods, and I haven't seen him since. Timmy, I reckon, went back to the mill where he works. Which mill? The windmill a bit north of Neuhof. Did you know any of Runt's people? Not a one. They didn't talk to us at all. None of their faces was familiar either. The only thing I know is they called that huge chief of theirs Runt, and Pius warned us to watch out for him. I don't suppose you know where they got to after the raid? On the way to Neuf, Timmy told me he was at their camp with Pius. I reckon that's where they've gone now. Did Timmy tell you where the camp is? Somewhere in the woods. He didn't say nothing more. Thing is, Timmy's got quite an imagination. But Pius roared at him to shut it, so I reckon there must be something in it. That's all I need to know. So now what do I do with you? Well... Hey, over here! people. We've got to get out of here. They're too close. We'll never outrun them. Fuck! At least they don't know I'm here. The two of us can take them by surprise. No fucking way. I'm gone. Look here. If you run, they'll catch up with you and kill you. And me too. Together, we stand a better chance. Oh, Jesus Christ. All right, I suppose you're right. Hey, who's there? What's, what are you doing here? I don't uh, oh. uh, what the matter? Come on, uh, come here. Uh, 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 hey. Oh. Fuck's sakes. You're a Yeah. Yeah. Fucking thing am. Are you killing? What's that? Well, yeah. Uh, 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 did, did, he, did he kill him?
Well, if he was up here. Yeah. Did he kill that dude? Dude. That's kind of shitty, man. I thought we were gonna like sneak up on him or sneak and like kill him, but fuck, dude. Where the fuck did he go? Guess he's dead, I guess. I don't fucking know. You fuck it, you need the money. No, I didn't want to lay down. I might as well sleep until day, though. I can fill up. Yeah, I didn't want to freaking getting killed. But now we gotta go find Timmy. Yeah.
Damn it. God. Damn, I thought the freaking cows are about to attack. <laughs> They're all like headed right for me. that one yet I can read this up. oh man I thought I had another book damn What are you bargaining? I can't sprint while I'm overloaded. This is just junk. in here. Just wait till noon, I guess. I'll be right back. Great, it's raining again. Only that fucking roof. That's some comfort, at least. I'm looking for a colossus by the name of Timmy. I heard he works here. A colossus. I don't know anyone like that. Uh oh. You better learn. You better figure out who it is. We're gonna be mean. Listen and listen well. It'll be better for everybody if you tell me. I'll be happy to know where I can find him. You'll be happy I don't have to get nasty with you and Timmy. I'm sure Timmy will be happy to stay alive. You... 
You don't want to hurt him? No, like I said, I just want to talk to him. All right, but not here. We'll talk round the back, behind the mill. Here I am. So, why all the secrecy? What do you want from Timmy? Can you tell me where to find him? Promise me nothing will happen to him. Why do you care so much? He's my brother. He's not very smart, you see. And he's always getting led astray by his no-good friends. And now there's some right peculiar characters looking for him. Who are they? I don't know. But they look like cutthroats. And they said some strange things, but I didn't tell them anything. That's good. But sooner or later they'll find him anyway. Tell me where he is and I'll take care of him. He's hiding at the Colburn farm, over by Merroyed. <laughs> I'm just gonna fucking beat his ass, dude. I get the feeling you're looking for someone here. I'm looking for someone too. Maybe we could help each other. I doubt it. I don't think so. No? Why not? Because I'm just going to kill you. Because I don't much like the look of you. You or your cronies. And I don't like you breathing on me. I don't like the way you stink. So fuck off. Well, well. Bold words for a whippersnapper like you. Come on then, let's see what you're made of. Retreat! Watch this. Up into the middle house, one at a time. Bring it Come on. Come on, one at a time. Oh, you can't get up here. He must be here somewhere. What do you mean? I'm right fucking here, you idiot. <laughs> Where could he have vanished to? He must be here somewhere. He must be here somewhere. <laughs> Don't weak at the knees. My turn. Damn it, I'm hitting you the wrong button. <laughs> I'm sorry to hear it, your buddy's dead. Oh, you lucky. Oh, now there they go with their ten swipes at once. Can I please go up? I cannot even see what the fuck's going on. Get on to the right person. Oh, I'm sorry about your buddies. Oh, now it's just me and you, pal. Yeah. You're dead! 
Bugger this! Fucking fence post. Ow. Uh, you can block if you want, buddy. This is ridiculous. This guy should have been dead already. Especially with my parrying and my blocking. It's, my guy's just not hitting like he's supposed to. Case dismissed. Anybody else? I thought there were four of you. Where did the other one die? Where did the other one die? There was four of them. I know they just didn't run off. Dude had to have died around in clubs. Oh, that's right. The other one was one that he like didn't have any armor on at all. I think he just ran off like a coward, didn't he? I'll take your aggression, sir. What'd you have on you? You know what? Just because I didn't like you, I'll take everything. And the same as you, I'll take everything. No, fuck it. I'll take all your shit too. Thank you kindly. Wait. Are we, are we missing a sword? Did one of you nerds drop another weapon? Listen here, buddy. Uh, I don't want to pick you up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's go talk back to the lady. Let her know that she don't have to worry about him no more. They would have killed me if it wasn't for the woodbill. <laughs> I don't want to pickpocket her. She it doesn't want me it won't allow me to talk to her. Damn, dude. She doesn't even want to freaking talk. Just gonna let her know, hey, they're dead. We are moving a slight slow. But that's fine. Let's go through some of this junk. It ain't worth nothing. Okay, well, we don't need the charcoal. Let's drop all that. The bread. Do I really... I don't even really use arrows. I could have probably used my bow on those guys. These boots ain't worth nothing. We don't need all any of this meat. It'll go bad before I can actually use it. 
Okay, these boots ain't really worth nothing. Can I get on my horse? Two overloaded amount up. Okay, that's fine. Then we'll drop this. Don't need the hoodie. Black picks don't weigh nothing. This is destroyed. Drop those two. Can I get on now? Still too heavy. <laughs> I need money. I want to buy that 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 sword, man. So we'll drop that. Drop this. Actually, before we do any of that, can we should repair some stuff. Do I have any more repair kits? That's something else. I need to buy more repair kits. What weapons? We don't need freaking five torches. We want to keep the dagger just in case I want to go on a murdering, murdering spree again. This weapon ain't worth two cents. Drop it. Dude, I don't need this many freaking heroes. Let's drop some. 50 is fine. I mean, that took up freaking a lot of space. What has my horse even got on me? Oh, yeah, he's got all this other stolen shit on him. Can't I sell that to somebody else, though? Will you shut up? Stop. Just stop. Just stop. Tired of barking, dude. I mean, that would be a good piece if it was fixed. Patched hose, four pairs. Another pair of patched hose. These weigh a lot. There we go. Okay, we need to go sell shit. We need to go somewhere where we can actually sell stuff. Definitely don't want to go here. These people hate me. And I hate them. Don't really want to go to Townburg. Neuhoff is freaking trying. Let's go here. I mean, maybe these people buy my stolen shit. Overloaded cannot fast travel. Alrighty. Let's get yeah. the ride then. We're gonna, we're gonna sell some stuff, see if they'll buy some of the stolen shit. It's from a different town. I mean, you will see if he steals something like the entire world knows. These are like the coolest woods. Like all the tree limbs, and there's really like no vegetation on the ground. There's trees everywhere. Woods that look like that look so cool. Like where there's like no bushes like this around, it's just like all flat. And that there's like nothing but a canopy of trees that you can't even see the sun. It's kind of cool. Yeah. Ooh, 
We yeah. have arrived. We've not sold anything in this town. Wait. This is not the same town, is it? Is this the fucking town that I think it is, the hate scene? You know, this is a different town. Yeah. The butcher. Look at you. Yeah. Must be the bailiff. All the bailiffs look the same. I'd say this town looks kind of like the other town. What? Oh, here we go. I guess. Good day to you. Good day. Good day to you. I would like to sell this. Yeah, see, I can sell. Well, a lot of it. Now we want to buy all your tailor's kids so I can start repairing my own shit. Now we gotta get all our shit off our fucking horse. And now we're over it again. Let's see. Ah, uh, well, oh, nope. Nope. It's still going to say that I'm, I'm selling stolen goods. So we will sell the stuff that we can for now. Oh, we can sell this hood. I didn't see that. Yet. He's probably going to say something about the stuff more than likely. Yeah, he ain't Do you want to get me in trouble? Don't. Yeah, yeah. Damn it.
Alrighty. Yeah. Yeah. It's over here. Come and get where's, it. Where's the blacksmith? She's just standing yeah. out there in the rain talking about her bread. Weird. That must be the bathhouses. Yeah. And okay. Oh, this is the blacksmith. I went right by him. Yeah. This guy's probably not gonna buy it either, but we'll see. What if I can just fix it myself? Yeah. What is her problem, Lady? What am I doing talking to a pauper like you? What? What the fuck was that about? Why was he being all fucking rude? Yeah, I don't know what that was about. You know what? Um, let me get rid of that. 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 Uh, the armor is probably in the same state. Sell all my apples. Sell my bread. Lewis. Yeah, I know, right? I don't think we can either. Yeah, we can sell that. So this dice, you know what that's for. Ornate golden goblet, I can't sell that. I don't need all these lockpicks. So, I'll keep five of them. I don't need that many. I never really fail that much. Now, let's go through this real quick. Arms, legs. I could wear this chest piece, but I don't like it. It didn't, well, it's not as good anyway. So here's what we're gonna do. Since I'm tired of carrying this shit on me, and apparently I can't sell it. Literally just gonna throw it all on the ground. There you go, buddy. Free shit. Time to get out of here. Might be easier if I fast travel here. No, it won't. Yeah. I'm gonna have to run up there anyway. <laughs> I hit that guy and he was like, <laughs> ah! Oh my god. 
I just like knocked my teeth out, dude. Fine, stupid horse. Yeah. Jump. Wait, let me see something. What is that place? Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Just jump, leave. Ah, traitor. Okay. Yeah. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Look at this keep knocking my shit out. Damn. Alright, finally. That took forever. My guy ain't got no teeth left. Is this like the witch or something? Hmm. Ah. Hey, Lady, I wasn't even yeah. near you. <laughs> this is the part where I ride my horse off of a cliff. I seen that it was going down, but I just wasn't sure how far. Usually it's a big ass cliff. At least that's how I died that one time. Take the weirdest paths. Most of them are direct paths. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Can I even get through this? Turn my horse. Am I stuck? Um. Oh, he's losing stamina. Well, hopefully he throws me off. I don't know, my, my horse is having a fit, dude. It's because he's stuck. He's like stuck in running mode. Shit. 
Yeah. Aha! Uh -huh, I saved it. Yeah. There we go. They put all these damn bushes here just for me. You, sir. It's Timmy. Timmy, you better fix that. You better fix that, Timmy. Hey, Timmy. How are you today? I'm all right. Uh, have we met? We have now. Huh? Oh, shit. What do you want? It wasn't me. I didn't... I mean... Shit. I saw what you did at Neuhoff. What are you talking about? You weren't there. I, I mean, I wasn't there. Don't waste uh -huh. your breath. You were there with Limpy Lubos Shit. and Riki. Well, I heard all about it. What do you want from me? Your mate Hinek told me about a whole camp full of those horse hunts. And I want to find it. I need to find it. Yeah, but... But why should I trust you, though? I'm not stupid. You might be one of them. Pretending to not be one of them. Trying to catch me out. I won't tell you nothing. Well, Timmy, we're going to beat your ass if you don't tell us. Listen here, Blockhead. I don't have all day for this. Tell me what I want to know so I don't have to hurt you. <laughs> no, please. I, I, I don't know nothing. <laughs> uh, almost nothing. I don't know where their camp is. That's a load of horse shit. Hinek <laughs> told me you were there, and that Pius warned you to keep your mouth shut. You must know something. Well, once I was there with them, yeah. Only, I was pretty drunk, so I'm not too sure. Try to remember. It was in the woods. In some kind of woods. You know, with uh, trees and stuff. There were some wrecked houses there and all. In the woods. A, a church. There was a church there. Kind of a broken one, though. Oh, great. Thanks a lot. Now it's all clear to me. Do you remember which way you went? It was straight north from Talmberg. When you go uphill from the castle, there's a path there round some barns, I think. It leads to the woodcutter's camp. If you go further on past the woodcutters, you come across this abandoned house. Can't miss it. Looks like a house. Only abandoned. Go to the left there and carry on till you come to this clearing with a big beech tree. Or was it an oak? Uh, you go left there again. There's this narrow path and you go straight along there. Sometimes it splits up. You just keep to the left until you come to a crossroads by this big flat rock. You keep straight on there. After a while, you'll see a bridge. And it's right there. Easy as you please. Better than nothing, I suppose. But you won't tell nobody about Neuhoff, right? You promise. Oh no, bugger. I meant to make you promise. But I forgot. No, don't worry. But in future, find some other way to make money. Like honest work? Thanks. I'll, I'll try. On account of my sister, at least. That girl at the windmill? Hi, Mirka. Did you talk to her? What did she say? She told me you're as thick as a fence post and always getting dragged into some mischief. Did she? Yeah, she's probably right. 
I cut him some slag. Oh shit. Now we gotta find this damn place. Yeah. A house, but only abandoned. Wait, this isn't it. Greetings, Henry. I hear you on the Rat Eye Tourney. Well done, lad. Damn straight. About that encampment, sir. What is it, lad? I found out about the camp from another of the bandits who deserted. He's called Timmy. Big fellow, but more brawn than brain. The camp is an abandoned village in the woods to the west of Townburg. Good work, lad. Have you been to check it out? Do you know how many of them there are? I don't know much apart from where it is. We really need to find out more. Could you go back there and try to discover anything that could help us in the assault? The more we know, the better. And if you could carry out some sabotage while you're in there, it would be invaluable. But don't take any unnecessary risks. I don't want to lose you. Certainly, sir. That is... I'll do what I can. That's what I like to hear. You'll be our eyes and ears, lad. Our success will depend on what you find out. Go, and get back here as soon as you can. Meanwhile, I'll muster my men. I'll find out what I can and be right back. Been a pleasure. <laughs> It's raining though. Oops. Oh, with his armor and everything? Yeah. Hey, look at this. What's him, buddy? What are you doing here? I'm hunting. What do you think? Hunting, of course. The bloody insolence. A poacher owning up to it. He's in my horse's alive. ass. You'll be thrown in jail for that, you bastard. And what if I don't go? Then I'll make you. Uh, he's gonna try to make me go to jail. I'll slay you. I love just picking fights with dudes in the woods for no reason. I ain't yeah. down with you, buddy. <laughs> I was gonna try my best not to laugh, dude. I can't fucking help it, man. Mm. <laughs> straight, straight face. 
But I was just, maybe he'll break his neck, but no, when he does that one, dude. Steal all. Dude, he's got some nice stuff. I don't think I need any of it, though. He doesn't even have any money, dude. Nobleman stuff. Junk. He doesn't have anything. This is a good fight, though. I mean, I was just simply riding my horse through here, and he wanted to get all on a rate, dude. Wait, what kind of sword has he got? No, it's junk. Alrighty, moving along. I don't have any points to me. That's what I forgot to check. What do I do? No, well, not in this. Combat. Each blow in an uninterrupted chain will hurt your opponent more than a previous one. I have a 20% greater strength, agility, warfare, and defense in a fight where you're outnumbered. Hey, I like that. Oh, Drinking. Care about charm. I would rather have better defense. Fifty percent less wear and tear would be the way to go. Yeah. Yeah. This is a death trap. Oh yeah, I'll uh, add my points and then fall to my death. Cutters camp. I can never get up here. Hey, we made it.
Go to the four with the rune cabin. Okay. Yeah. Was it this way? Yeah. Maybe. Stay left. There's the cabin. I wonder if there's anything in that cabin. I never find anything useful. Yeah. Said basically just keep left. Well, oh, yep. There's yeah. a clearing. There's a left. Left at the next fork. Hope I'm going the right way. Oh, there's the left. Damn it, almost passed it. Oh, what's this way though? Yeah. We'll check it out. I just want to see this. There's no way to get in these fucking places besides the way I was going. Wait, aha! Uh -huh. All junk. Long distance arrows. Yeah, at least I found something, but found something, but nothing. Yeah. It was right over this way until we run into the roadie. Okay, here we go. Yeah. Up. Oh, this must be the big rock. Keep going straight. Wait. Take a left and carry on. Going straight through the crossroads all the way to the camp. Yeah. Sabotage the bandits for the something. The moat. It would take a while to get across, and there's nowhere to shelter from arrows. Actually, stealthier in the rain. There's two dudes there. The stockade. A handful of men could hold it for quite a while. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do any sabotage. 
They can see a long way from that steeple. And those arches up there, definitely going to be a problem. Good ground for a big fight, but not much cover. Well, hell, I'm like practically in their fucking town. Oh shit, there's a guard right there. I get like extra, I get like a stealth bonus in the rain, thank god. So I'm just like running around here. As far as I haven't been seen. Plus, I'm already fucked up. Damn it. Just fast travel it back. Trying to find my way back here. You know Get back on your horse. All right, what town am I in? Oh, well, this isn't town, bird. Well, it's a lot closer than it was. Yeah. I can not see shit. Oh, thank God we're close. Not closer than I thought, but I cannot see nothing. Need a bed. You guys really hogging all the beds, man? Why can't I sleep? There's not one bed. 
I don't want to talk to him right now. I just wanted to sleep. I just want to sleep. Wait. Hey, we found a bed. <laughs> you know it's one of their beds, dude. They're gonna be like, get out of my bed. You know they will. What, you think you can just sleep in somebody's bed? <laughs> it's just hey. <laughs> well, I'm not gonna get woken up. Yeah, yeah. It was your bed, wasn't it? Well, I wasn't done sleeping. <laughs> he won't let me sleep. Let's try it again. Nope. He's getting pissed. <laughs> it's his bed. You can't be serious. <laughs> Sleeping in other people's beds. Uh, get out of the way. Get up. What are you doing lying here? Get the hell out. Oh, shoot. We'll sleep in Sarazic's bed, dude. He's up. <laughs> Beggars can't be choosers. I just wanted to sleep until day. <laughs> Maybe hopefully the rain will stop. Hey, get up off that. <clears throat> what is the fucking tournament today? Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Did it say the tournament was today? Did I... Dude... Is... is I, am I not gonna make the Rantai, Rantai tournament now? There's no fucking way I'm going to make it in time, if it's today. It didn't tell me it was the Rattay tournament unless it's supposed to be the following day. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> I just want to get to the turn of it. I think it starts at noon. If I can make it there in time. It's gonna be fucking close. I don't know if it's today or not, that's the thing. Oh, come on, dude. You're right. Well then. I'd like to win. All right. All right, we're going to do this and then we're going to crack call tonight. Here you are. And we I'll made write your it. Name Henry, you said. And I need to. Long, Long sorry. We're going to do the tournament and then I'm going to call tonight. It's already past my bedtime. Yeah. <laughs> and they did. I was afraid to eat. Entering the arena now will be Yera of Beneshoff, called Kippa. 
a mercenary We're smoke by profession. And he will face Henry of Skellets from the company of Sir Ratzik Kabla. Welcome, our warriors. And this very first bout will afford plenty of entertainment. We will witness a duel with longswords. A very fast duel. <laughs> I just like I feel quite. <laughs> Oh, I blocked all that shit, you bitch. Come here, you little asshole. The second bout will surely be no less exciting. This one may decide the winner. Our warriors will fight with hunting swords. <coughs> Come on, he's gonna attack right off the bat. He always does. Told you. With swords. <laughs> Hunting. <laughs> and shall proceed to the next round. Entering the arena now will be Henry of Skelets from the company of Sir Ratzik Kabla, who will measure his skills against Kolgo o the Tar, Catchbowl of the Ratai Bailiff. Welcome, our warriors. God, this guy takes so long. And this very first bout will afford plenty of entertainment. We will witness <laughs> a duel with longswords. Bailey. I'm just gonna hit you. Fuck it. Uh, 
You're not gonna hit me, I'm just gonna hit you, dude. Go swing or Go not? ahead and gather your strength. I don't need my strength. I don't need to swing. And now's the time to choose weapons for the next duel. The combatants will engage in a duel with war hammers and shields. Go ahead, do your first attack. They always do. Fuck! Told you. See, he keeps countering me. Oh, that's bullshit. Uh, stand him up, please. That's bullshit. I lost. I lost because that was bullshit. I went up to lock in with him and he didn't let me lock in with him. Yeah, it's all good. I'll get him next round. Give me a different weapon. I hate fucking Warhammers. As it's customary, the weapons for the third bout have been chosen by our gracious Sir Hanush. Prepare to watch a fierce fight with Axe. Sir Hanush has shitty pick. Shitty taste. Bitch. I'm just gonna quit swinging at this point. Cause fucking he just counters me every time. Yeah, see, he still countered me. I'm no good at this weapon, dude. Ah! <laughs> 
Having proved his combat skills in this round and emerged victorious, he shall proceed to the next round. What's the matter? That's some new kind of game. <laughs> They're like, it's a new kind of game. I'm all creeping around. A new kind of game. The first Good long swords. Will be Henry of Skullets from the company of Sir Radzik Kobla. And his adversary will be Coleman, man at arms of Sir Hanush of Lipa. Welcome, our warriors! Oh, come on, get done talking, buddy. The combatants have entered the arena, and the first duel may commence! We will witness a duel with longswords! Second bout. Our warriors will fight with hunting swords. Shit. <laughs> Why is he already custom for? Oh, I guess he already knew he's gonna be here. Jewel in today's Ratai Tourne, for which we all owe gratitude to Sir Hanush of Lipa. All glory to the victor, mm -hmm. Henry of Scalitz, man at arms in the company of Sir Radzik Kobila. His prize will be given to him by our gracious Sir Hanush. Put your butt down here and give me my stuff. Don't make me come up here and get it. Damn, I do have to wait for him to come down. Here, Henry. Your prize. Thank you. Thank you so much. You've earned it. Farewell. I don't know. Do I really like that helmet? I know it's a probably a better helmet, but 
I like being able to see what's going on. Yeah. It's a better helmet, man, but I don't think I like it, dude. So I pull my weapon out. Oh, then I gotta fight like this. Hmm. I guess I'll wear it. It's better and. I don't know, I just don't like it. Even when the cutscenes are gonna be talking with that fucking mask on. <laughs> I like seeing my dude's face. Uh, I don't. Uh, I don't know if yeah. I want to wear that because I just I like to you know, see my guy's face. Like I'm all busted up or not. Plus, like when I get into a fight, man, I won't be able to see nothing. Uh, let's get the sword I want. G'day. Yeah, see? <laughs> the guy looks goofy as hell. 28. We're going to sell this. Sold. And then we are going to buy this one. I know, right? <laughs> like big chicken, I know. Dude, we got the best sword he sells, so... Good people, come up close and have a smell. Fresh bread. That does not fucking sound right. Get up close God and smell. Good luck to you. I don't think I want to get up close and smell. We'll sell that. I like my hat I have. Oops. I don't know, I sold it for a nice penny. That's for damn sure. Do I need to repair my shit? Too damaged to repair my dagger. I'll just use it for stabbing people though. You don't have anything to combine what? Oh. Oh, did we not wear our, our... Where's our hat? Dude, I didn't sell it, did I? Look at it. Alright. What am I to do? A, a poor wretch whose home was burned. Alright, I'm gonna have to call it right there, guys. I gotta go to bed. I'm not raiding or doing anything like that. I'm just gonna go ahead and cut it. Yeah, Paul. Guys. Have a good one. Thanks for hanging out. And I will see you guys tomorrow. We'll probably try to focus on the storyline. Um, I think my guy's good enough. I just need, you know, but if the Rattay tournament comes up, I'm going to go do it. Because I just want the armor pieces. So, Alright guys, have a good night. Later.